Hi, this is Kara from Karen Kirk Creative. If you're new to me in the channel, we do both done for you and DIY web websites and all manner of online business systems. Today, I have a quick tutorial showing you Wave accounting. So this is for anyone who is a service provider who is looking for a good invoicing system to be able to take payments from their clients and also some proposals. Um, so here, I'll take it over my shoulder. This is actually my own Wave account. So some of the information will be blocked off. But you can see over here, we have sales and payments. We can do estimates. It's not a super robust feature. If you create an estimate, it basically, here, you can see what this one looks like. Um, it essentially looks the same as an invoice. So I don't necessarily see the point um, in using this feature necessarily. But you can see that you can customize. You can customize this color and your logo. And this is the same on an invoice. Um, Recurring invoices you can also do here. So I have some clients on a retainer. They have a recurring invoice. Um, they're doing this new checkouts feature if you have more of like a button you want to use for your services. Um, but the invoice feature is really quite nice. Um, I'll show you what an invoice looks like. Um, so you can see here, once you set it up, you have the option of sending reminders automatically. Um, I can't stress that enough. Reminders are great for people. Um, but you can see again what the invoice looks like. It's very um, professional looking. You can download it as a PDF. You can also send it as a link. When you go to create an invoice, it will store all your customer stuff. So if you have repeat customers, they'll be in here. You can also add a new customer. I'm going to click somebody. Um, your services, however many you have add on things, they can all go in here. So you can add an item, you can also add tax. So I have it one tax that's set up in here, you can go ahead and send it, you can add notes, you can actually require that people um, consent to the terms before paying. So this way you can use it a little bit like your contract and your um, payment all in one, um, depending on how sort of specific you need your contracts to be. So that's all in there, you can also do your accounting if you want to track your expenses in here. I don't do that, but um, that is an option. So you can see, you can add them. So you can do a real profit loss. You can run reports from here. There's a bunch of different reports. You can also do your 1099s. So this is a very robust option, I think, for a free payment system. Um, it is completely free. There is no monthly or annual charge the way that uh, QuickBooks or a similar um, software system has. It does do the standard payment fee, I think 2.9%, um, which is not nothing, but it is pretty standard. So like PayPal, um, Stripe, all do the same thing. But the upside to this platform is it does send very professional looking invoices and does keep everything in one nice place as well as automated reminders. So if you're somebody who is looking to switch systems or you're starting out in business and sort of vetting platforms, this is one that I recommend. I've been using it since I was a health coach before transitioning into this work. Um, and it's, it's just easy. So no, nothing bad to say about it. It's not as robust maybe as some QuickBooks options, but for most people, I think it's totally fine. All right. If you found this video helpful, please be sure to drop a like on it. And as always, you can subscribe to the channel for future updates. Thanks.